So, hi guys, it is Buffy here. Welcome back to my channel. And today we are finally getting to um, go through Yuki Kashiwagi's latest photo book experience that she released for her 30th birthday. Um, yeah, I wasn't able to get this or like pre order this or anything. I wasn't able, so I wasn't able to get this when it was first released because Yes Asia for some reason refused to ship this to any part of Europe. For some bizarre and unknown reason, they refuse to ship this to Europe. Um, so I had to buy this on Macari, but I'm very happy to finally have this and let's go through it. So this is the front. And here is the back. And this is the spine. Yeah, let's start. She's so pretty it's it, it's it's not fair <laughs> i love this picture i don't know why i guess i just kind of love the whole kind of candidness of it of like it just it doesn't look like you know she's posing it just kind of looks like she's just sort of there in the moment and I, I like I like that kind of picture she's so pretty <laughs> she's so pretty I'm gonna cry <laughs> Oh, I love her hair in this. Like, once again, like, I do kind of like, I like that it's very sort of candid. If I, once again, like, I don't know if, like, that even makes any kind of sense, but it's like, I'm trying to do it in a way that you guys understand. Like, I, I kind of like pictures where it doesn't look like where they're overly sort of made up and things like that. I kind of like it when it looks far more natural. Oh my god, that picture is gorgeous. Like, the lighting. Like, oh. Uh, I, 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 I want that as, like, my, um, uh, what do you call it? My, like, home screen or something, or my, um, uh, phone case. That was the one that I was struggling to find. This is actually the first Japanese photo book that I've kind of ever bought. Um, I mean, I have like Japanese photo books of K-pop groups, but I don't have one. I, I this is like the first one that I have of a Japanese um, act.
I would love to have like a wardrobe like that. <laughs> it, you know, it's kind of it's kind of times like these when like I wish that like Europe or something or maybe like an English speaking country had like an affiliate sister group. So I could be a part of it, but like I feel I I know, I kind of know for a fact I'm too old now because I yeah I'm 24, <laughs> so I think and I think for a lot of the groups I think that cut the cutoff age is like 22, so I'm way too old. That's another picture I would love to have as like my desktop background or something. I'm just... I think that's the receipt. <laughs> I didn't realise I was in there. I do kind of find this interesting and to me it makes sense um, for people to just release like photo books and I wish more um, Western artists did it um, because I, I, I kind of I, I kind of think that uh, maybe kind of like a lot of boy groups or boy bands rather. I think if they released photo books, like if One Direction released a photo book in like 2011, it would be, I swear, it would be like a Times bestseller or something. Um, I, I, I don't quite understand like why they haven't really caught on in the west actually i'm not i don't know it just doesn't quite make sense to me because like it's like if a group is popular and it's like you can sell t-shirts and postcards or whatever with their faces on it why not sell photo books you know Victor is so cute. <laughs> She's so cute. But I think, yeah, I think just one thing I love about sort of um, Japanese, certainly I think Japanese idols is the simplicity um, of them in the sense that they're not overly made up. They're not perfect all the time um and i don't think they are supposed to be um and i kind of feel like that makes them far more relatable oh my gosh this dress is gorgeous I love these pictures so much. Like the the cinematography of them is gorgeous. I 
think that is everything. Oh, so there's that picture on the inside, and then yeah, this is kind of a continuation. So that is everything in this unboxing. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope to see you guys again in another video very, very soon. Bye.